Gary here from Mr G Shave, back for my Friday head shave, and I've been looking forward to this one. I don't know, it feels like my hair's grown a hell of a lot since last week. I don't know whether you can see how much it's grown, but there you go. That's what happens when you leave it for a week. Um, I've, um, I'm going to start off with the hardware as usual, but I just wanted to mention I've had a small parcel in the post, which I will be opening tomorrow and probably using. Um, uh, I won't say who it's from or where it's from, <clears throat> but suffice to say it's interesting. Um, but there we are. Right, so that's going to happen tomorrow. That unboxing will happen tomorrow. There's only one thing in it. I have opened it. I haven't really looked at what it is, but I, I've got an idea because they sent me an image of what they were sending. So anyway, right. Um, what am I using today? I'm using my leaf razor. I only use this for head shaves, I don't use it for face shaves. Um, it's brilliant for head shaves. I, I don't get on with it for the face shaves. I've got to admit, um, not my favorite. Let's put it that way. Um, so yeah, so there's that. And then I'm using the Yaki Freedom Italian brush. Um, it's got the coin in the bottom and I believe this is called a cashmere knot. It feels really soft. Um, so I'm, I'm looking forward to using this. So I'm going to drop that straight in the water. And I'm not going to stop to get ready for the shave. Because I'm, as, as is the norm with uh, head shaves, I'm using a cream. So I'm just going to wet the, fa wet, wet the face, wet the head, or wet the dome. Get some agua on it. <coughs> Excuse me. And then the pre-shave is going to be Prorazzo. And I've got water dripping all down my face. So yeah, Prorazzo. Make sure that focuses. Prorazzo Red. So I hope everybody's had a great week. And uh, they're all, we were all looking forward to the weekend. I think the weather's going to be okay this weekend. I'm not 100%, but um, I think it's okay. I think it's going to be cool, but not too bad. Might actually see some sun this weekend. So, yeah. <clears throat> and I've got to get down the pub Uh on Sunday, I think I might. It might even go tomorrow because I've got to try and see a friend of mine because I've got some razors for him. So, so yeah. Right. So, what am I using as a soap today? Well, it's actually a cream. I'm using tobacco, as you can see, as you probably saw on the the uh, entry sort of thumbnail to the video. So tobacco, it's a tobacco shave day today. Um, just put the razor in there. I don't feel organized today. It has been a quite weird, you know, lots of unexpected things happening. Oh. The one thing I'll say about this tobacco shave cream is it's a little bit runny. I don't know whether you, you can't really shake it, but, uh, and it doesn't look very appetizing, if you know what I mean. But there we are. Right, so let's get on with it. Let's lather up. Yeah, this is a very soft brush. I love this brush. I, I like the handle. It fits in the hand really well. I love the Italian colors. I was thinking of doing a full Italian shave. But then I thought, it's a leaf day today, so, but I was gonna, I wanted to use this cashmere knot. So, let's see what I use tomorrow, I don't know. No, I've got to use that tomorrow, so it is a brush. And I've given it away now, but yeah, it is a brush. So as usual, I'm gonna spray straight into the brush. Just two sprays, stick it on the dome. Just 
just add a little bit of water at a time. Oh, the scent off tobacco, I love it. I'm going to change it up a bit and put the water directly on the dome. And I think we're ready for the shave. So yeah, I hope you all had a great week. Um, I know there are some of us who haven't and my heart goes out to them. Um, but I'm not not going to keep continue harping on but I'm just letting you know I'm still thinking of you all um, but I don't know what to say don't you feel a bit impotent when things like this are going on in the world there's nothing you can really do right that feels great um, Let's get on with the shave. So these are Euromax blades still in here. I think this is the fourth use on these. time I use this it, it always sort of underlines the fact that this is my favorite head shaver it's just so easy it really is you don't have to think about it it's very relaxing I love it So what have you got planned this weekend? What have you got? What shaves have you got planned? Um, you're gonna go down, go out and have a few drinks. Are you celebrating anything? What meals are you having? Um, I'm doing, or at least I think I'm doing, a Persian um, brisket of beef that's slow cooked. Um, for five to six hours in fact, in fact I think it's nearly seven hours it gets cooked for once you've done all the bits and bobs and added other ingredients <clears throat> but <clears throat> suffice to say it's got harissa in it and various other things peppers <clears throat> things like that so that feels great Let's go for a bit more agua. Go for the second pass. Across the grain. These blades are holding up really well. As Jim Will Shave said, you know, these can last four or five shaves. It's on its fourth use now, so, and I'm really happy with the way they're performing. I've got some interesting razors coming up, both straight and DE. Um, they'll be coming up it's interesting because I mean you all know that I've got the Masa Tatara Masamuni Nodachi um, razor um, so you all know I've got that one but I've just bought um, a Razzarini flat I think it's called flat boy um, so that will be featuring soon but I have got a few requests um, 
that I've got to get through before I start to feature that. Um, and then I've got some really nice, I've got a Philharmonica straight razor, I think it's a 4 8 uh, And I've got a Bismarck, Dovo Bismarck as well. So both second hand, obviously, Phil Philharmonica obviously is second hand, but the Dovo Bismarck is, is uh, second hand as well. So... <clears throat> But yeah, so they'll be featuring on my Wednesday shaves coming up. Looking forward to using those. I've actually got another Dovo in my collection that I haven't used yet. I did a, a trade for it. Um, and that's the entry level Dovo, which is a 5 8 round nose. Um, I think the Bismarck's a 6 8 So yeah, I've got a few things coming in. The other thing I, I needed to sort of mention is um, the giveaway. Nav M, you haven't responded. You haven't uh, sent me an email. Um, so unless you reply by tomorrow, I'm going to be doing another draw tomorrow. Um, so please, Nav, if you, uh, if you watch this, let me know what your choice is. Otherwise, tomorrow's shave, I'll be redrawing the giveaway prize. Because uh, I haven't sent anything off to Glenn yet, because I'm waiting for, you know, everybody to sort of respond. Glenn's responded, and I know what he wants. And as soon as I know <clears throat> whether you respond now, or whether there's somebody else who wins tomorrow, can, if you can get back to me as soon as possible so that I can order the stuff and get it sent out. Because um, I, ideally I want to see if I can actually buy the soaps all from one vendor, so that I'm only paying one set of postage. But we'll see, we'll see. You know, it's your choice what, what you want to get. Um, but yeah, right, against the grain and pick up. This is great, it's pretty much completely BBS. Just checking, yeah. Yeah, so I've told you what food I'm having. I've told you I'm going down the pub. Um, Tell me what you're having as a special meal on Sunday. Um, are you into cooking? I do love my cooking, I must admit, I do enjoy it. And people have said that I'm pretty good at cook cooking, so I did have some training when I was younger, when I lived out in Germany. Um, I worked at the Sheraton Hotel in Munich. And I, ha I spent some time in the kitchens there, so I do have a bit of a background in chefing, if you like, but... Oh, this is fantastic. So let's have a feel around. That's BBS. Right, I'm going to do my usual thing at this point. I'm going to clean up and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Ready for the post shave. Cold rinse time. Get this cold water running. So yeah, very enjoyable shave. Cold water. That is cold. Oh, fantastic. <clears throat> uh, 
Uh, oh yeah, I've got to do the do the alum. Don't think it's necessary, but may as well do it. Oh, bit of a sting there. Make sure I don't get it in my eye. I think that was too late. No, it's not too bad. Only a bit of a sting there. I've learnt you really got to catch those drips off the dome very quickly when you're using alum because if you get it in your eye it's uh, really unpleasant. <clears throat> Right, that feels great. Just a little bit of steam there, for whatever reason that was. So I'm just gonna wipe this straight off. It's not stinging anymore. Apart from my eye a little bit, it's not too bad though. I think that the tiniest amount just got in there. Oh, that feels great. Oh, the head shave of the week is always sort of the zen moment and you know you've got you know the weekend to enjoy and mind you it's a fairly busy weekend for me I've just found out my daughter one of my daughters is having or my oldest daughter is having work done on her house and they're basically builders um, building an extension and apparently they've destroyed the soil pipe from the upstairs bathroom in some of the work they were putting a an RSJ or something in the a steel, a steel beam or whatever supporting beam in and they took out the soil pipe to the upstairs bathroom so they've got no shower no toilet upstairs nothing um, and luckily my son's a plumber so um, I think We'll be spending some time over there fixing what they've broken. So, yeah. But anyway, not I'm not going to be doing anything. Not with my back, but my son, he'll... He says it sounds like an easy fix, but he's got to have a look at it first. Right, so I'm using tobacco aftershave. Oh. oh, I just... I do love the scent of tobacco. It's a good six, seven out of ten in strength, scent strength. Um, the the cream not so much, maybe five out of ten, but I think the soap, the hard soap, is has got a stronger scent to it. And then I'm finishing up with Tobacco Original, which a Tobacco Original lotion, so aftershave balm. So I'm only going to put a little bit, just a tiny little bit there. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of the shave. So Nav, let me know, get in touch. Um, let me know what it is, you, ne what, you know, what you've chosen, whether that's signature soaps or Wickham soaps. If you don't respond by the time I shave, which will be about lunchtime UK time, if you don't respond by then, unfortunately, I'm going to have to draw, draw the prize again. Um, and Glenn, sorry about the wait. I haven't sent anything off to you yet, but rest assured, as soon as the part two prize winner gets in touch, I'll be sending all the products out together. That's it for me. I'll see you tomorrow. Nav, get in touch. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow for the face shave. Bye now.